the most common and most fun one is the, the one with the exoskeleton. Even as brood 10 cicadas die off, one artist in North Bethesda transforms their corpses and shells into pieces of jewelry. And we collect these after they've lost their lives to the cycle of living, and we cover them in copper. So crazy as it sounds, the actual bug is still inside. Dennis Ray, owner of Nature's Creations, has been making and selling botanical jewelry and natural art for more than 40 years. The necklaces have been very, very good. This is an example of uh, a, we call them retracted wing um, cicadas. He discovered his craft at Woodward High School in the late 70s through an art project he had in a chemistry class. Since then, Ray has traveled the world, collecting leaves and covering them with copper. So the leaves sort of were, were a great segue into insects, although insects are much more difficult to do. I sort of perfected my cicada um, recipe 17 years ago, continued to work on it uh, you know, through the years, and we were really ready this, this year to do it properly. During the 2004 emergence, Ray gave his nieces and nephews 25 cents for each cicada exoskeleton they collected. 17 years later, his nieces and nephews are too grown up for the brood 10 cicadas. But that doesn't mean the collection process is no longer a family affair. Ray's parents are now in on the action, free of charge. They're really in good health, but 87 and 92, and they're out collecting hundreds of uh, specimens every day from their neighbor's yard and their yard, is, of course, and it just makes them laugh and it makes them have purpose. Uh, so it's, it's kind of fun. It's an adventure. How many pieces of jewelry, and you're also making sculptures, how many would you estimate that you have made so far? Oh, several hundred, I would have to say. People have a fascination with the cicada, even when they're not blooming. So we will have this in our line for a number of years. So we, we sort of take the moment right now to capture the pieces and then um, continue to offer them in the future. It's only a matter of time before the cicada's song fades away. But if you can't wait until 2038 when they emerge again, you can purchase one of nature's creations, cicada jewelry and sculpture pieces online at leafpin.com or at a local art exhibition. So these bugs sat underground for 17 years waiting for their, you know, with several weeks of joy and then died. So, <laughs> you know, sometimes you have to stop and think and, and look at the detail of nature and appreciate it and understand that it's it's around us everywhere to be appreciated. Reporting from IMCM, I'm Deirdre Byrne. Like, share, and subscribe to our channel to stay informed on all things in Montgomery County.